Hello and welcome to the show. We are back today on Teardown. Yes, going to be causing some more destruction and mayhem and probably not doing what I'm supposed to be doing. I said last time we were going to start by testing out the tractor because I hadn't seen this before. So let's test out the tractor. It's not as strong as I... Either that or the crops are very strong. I was kind of expecting more from the tractor. Maybe these are just incredible. In fact, we had a car get stopped by a tree before, so maybe it is just that the foliage is super strong. I feel like we're not getting any progress through there. Can we drive it? Come on. Come. Have I got a tractor stuck? Oh, for God's sake. Go away. Can I start a fire in the fields? I would expect... Oh, I'm not close enough. Fire? Jeez, these are the strongest crops in the world. What are we growing here? Excuse me. Uh, I mean, I can hit it with a sledgehammer gets rid of them. Can we get... Okay, there we were free at last. Well, I say at last. I was going to try and drive this through the outbuilding over there and see what happens. Yeah, don't maybe drive this through the... No, okay, I think it's just the tractor's not very good. I think that's what we're learning here. The tractor is just a bit pants. Oh, it's not even much of a building, really. <laughs> Disappointing. Well, I mean, we're here now. It only seems right that we should go and crash through it. Oh. Okay, surely that's got to be able to burn. Oh, it's fallen over. <laughs> oh, that is some clever, that is some clever physics. That is some really clever physics. Will you burn? Yes. Woom. Let's just start a nice barbecue out here, shall we? While well, that gets going, can we cut a tractor in half? I'll go do a mission in a minute. I'm just curious. Something, surely there is going to be a vehicle that I, oh, no, I don't think I'm going to cut like, the engine block in half by the looks of it. God damn it. There will be a vehicle. Wait, can I make a convertible tractor? Oh, careful. Careful where we're going with the blowtorch. I'm going to guess it probably... Yep. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Sorted. Okay, so we can turn cars into convertibles. Oh, it's a lot of smoke. I guess it didn't really like me. Yep, I'm going to put that on the fire now. Can that burn? I don't know. Right, we'll just leave that doing its thing. I'm sure nothing bad can come of that at all. Ooh, bloody hell, we're nearly flying. <laughs> Leap through the fields of corn. I presume it's corn. It might not be. Anyway, I digress. We've already... Well, you weren't expecting massive progress, were you? And if you were, you've come to the wrong place. Uh, what mission are we doing today other than burning down our own buildings for fun? I don't actually know. Come on, door. We'll, we'll use a door like a normal being. For now. We don't want to start a mission. Uh, oh, yes. I just want to load it up. I don't want to get upgrades. So, we can't upgrade the fire extinguisher or anything. The blowtorch, we have all the fuel we can get. The shotgun, I don't really use the shotgun much. It can be quite good. But I guess we get a lot of upgrades. All right, now, plank. I want to make that as long as possible because that'll be helpful for getting around. Bloody hell, I used all of my money. Uh, <laughs> crap. Uh, I can't afford anything else. Well, I feel like the planks are going to be useful, so we're going to go with that. Right, missions. Uh, we are going to this one. We're going to be lifting a safe, I think it is. Um, move the safe to your escape vehicle, if possible. Also get the other safe and pick up all key cabinets. Oh dear. <laughs> this sounds like a run around like a lunatic sort of a mission. Great. Oh, wow, we're going to load the safe on a boat. I can see a million and one ways that this is going to go wrong, and we're probably going to find most of them. Can I knock this down? I'm going to go with probably, because it's made of wood and it's already crumbling. Well, I mean, it seems like a good place to start. Let's just hammer away at it. Oh! <laughs> and down goes the watchtower. Right, I'm not being ludicrously destructive for no good reason. I mean, it's for a good reason. You know what? I can't be bothered to go through the door. That works. Right. <laughs> what are we stealing? Okay, primary target is the office safe. Now, I'm going to presume we need to use the crane to lift it up and over, maybe? And then all of these other ones, secondary targets, are they all alarmed? I saw on the gate, I'll remember eventually, that it's tab to close that for a second, I thought there was a fire going on that I had... Knock, knock. Anybody home? Am I going to have to drive a bulldozer through you? Oh, crap. <laughs> it is all alarmed. I don't want to deal with alarmed stuff. Oh, just wanted to destroy things. Oh, I can't actually... I was going to try to go across on something. Never mind. 
Uh, right, what have we got in terms of options here? How the hell am I going to do this? This is going to be a mad dash around here, because I can't move... I can't move that first one. We're going to have to break into there somehow. At least by the looks of it, it's all movable. Oh, there we go. Yeah, at least the looks of it, it is all... Um, oh, it's not movable, sorry, it's all stationary stuff. The, the safe must be movable if I've got to actually manually move it to the uh, exit point. Sorry, that is a door, isn't it? Uh, it's a door that's locked. Well, you know, I have a way to deal with a door that's locked. <laughs> knock, knock. Does it work now? Yes, it does. Wonderful stuff. <laughs> what are you? Ah, you are vending machines. Well, free soda now if you want. It is busted. You know what? That also works. Fantastic stuff. Ah, I will nick your painting. It's only $25, but there we go. Okay, the safe's in here. Oh, crap. That's alarmed. Wonderful. How the hell am I going to do this? Right, okay. Hmm. How on earth do we do this? I'm not sure. I mean, the last one I could see. I could figure out. I mean, okay, how do we do this if we want to get the bonus objectives as well? Um... That does the trick. So, I can just... I can, I can pick up these. They're all free to be picked up. Now, I mean, the crane... Let's face it, the crane journey isn't crazy... It's not a crazy long journey that we have to go on for the crane. Come on, let's just cut the grate apart here. Well, we could duck in. By the looks of it, I'm probably going to... Oh, wait, that's not going to fall down like I want it to, is it? Because it's kind of attached to the wall. It's wasting a lot of my blowtorch for no real good reason. Other than it's kind of fun doing the whole... Uh, you know, we're just going to do that. That works. <laughs> okay, let's let's go and prepare the crane, I guess, is what we're going to have to do next. I feel like this is the best way to move that safe. Well, I'm not sure it's the best way, but it's probably the most likely to work way. I think. Hold on. Now, can we just clear the pipes out of the way, if you please? Thank you. <laughs> Don't mind me. We're just preparing for extraction. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Before we prepare for extraction, I'm just going to drop a quick save here. Okay, we're just going to drop a quick save here. We're going to line the crane up as best I can. What is that hooked onto? Nothing useful. Uh, fight the camera a little bit. What have we got there? Is that the safe? No, that's just some random debris. Drop the random debris out of the way. I mean, I feel like this is... I feel like this should be the difficult bit. And then we're going to have to try and do this really quickly at the end of frantically running around like a lunatic. Have I got... Okay. That is the... Okay, the crane is attached. So, when we back the crane up, that's gonna go. We've got to get the crane turned around. We've got to get the crane out the bloody... Jeez, it's gonna take a lot of that time just to do the crane journey. Let's have a... What have we got? So, we can jump... We can grab that relatively... oh... <laughs> I feel like we can get that, that, run across there somehow, maybe through the building, there might be a way to make a, a path through here, grab that, and then we're out the window, into the crane, reverse, and out. I don't know how I'm gonna get that one in time. I guess what we can do is... if we drive there... I mean, I haven't checked the other ones. I'm presuming the other ones are timed as well. I'm presuming everything has alarms on it here. I could be wrong, of course, with this. Knock, knock! Hello! How are we doing in here? Uh, do you have something that I am looking for? I hope so. And through the next door. 
Well, it's not really a door. It is a door now, I will say that much. We have made it a door. Um, and then for the exit point, I guess we're going to go and like crash through here. Come on, dump truck. You can do it. Uh, I don't know what actually entrance... Actually, I'm going to probably be entering from this side. I'm not sure the destruction I did first was necessary. It was fun, but I believe it was a little bit unnecessary in all of this. We're just going to crash through this bit of the door. Please don't set off the alarm. I think I'm far enough away. Does that look like that's a sensible way in? Can we get in to the thing that we need to do? Ooh, valuable. Clonk. Okay. It's a little bit messy. Can I grab this out of the way? Yes, we can. Haha. Uh -huh. Shelf. Away, be free. That's a good throw. Bloody hell. <laughs> Got one hell of a throw. I think it's a shelf. Well, there might not be a shelf. It's something. Be free. Whoa. <laughs> we have been working out. Can I get to the top? No, surely not. I take it back. We've cleared an electricity pylon. Bloody hell, I must be the strongest person in the world. Right. So that's the last thing, and that's not going to take very long. There's a little bit of debris around, and we can deal with that. That's not a problem. Okay. Cool. What have we got? Oh, I was going to figure out how I can get between the buildings. There's definitely a way to, to shortcut it, if you like. Well, kind of shortcut it. Let's go upstairs and see what we're working with. Okay, so we know that one there's got that. And then if we run upstairs here... There is oh a drink. Christ, how the hell am I gonna I don't know how I'm gonna do I can't do that efficiently. <laughs> this is me we're talking about. But what I can do let's not forget we have the planks now. So by the looks of it, the other thing we need is in there. Okay, so there to there to over there. Let's just have a look. So there to there, we're in this building. Okay, that is actually a sensible walkway through there. Okay, that's good news. That makes my life a little easier. Uh, right, so... I don't know if I can actually blowtorch. Okay, well, I can't really blowtorch through whatever that is. Go away. Now, I'm going to do a quick save because... Actually, you know what? I'll show you what happens. Or at least... I'm hoping I will show you what happens if you try and knock the... Okay, there we go. Thankfully, it does show that. Yeah, if you knock the alarm box off, you, you're going to be in trouble. So, <laughs> this is why I'm going to the effort of cutting the wall apart. I don't know how good the shotgun is. I presume not... Well, maybe the shotgun is good for this. Possibly. It saves me some ammo. Ammo? Well... Saves me some blowtorch. Okay, so we can run along here. Duck into here. Grab that. Turn around. And then it's... Str I don't know why I'm pressing shift. Just like instinct press shift. Turn around. Run out here. We can grab... How do I do that? Right. I am... Back and still confused as to how the hell am I ever going to get a second safe out? Uh, I don't know how to do that one. I, I really don't, unless there is some way I can deactivate this. Oh, I think... Ooh, I think I'm going to have to do a pass. It's going to be difficult enough to, to just to do the bits that I've got set up here, really. Unless there is some trick that I don't know about. Because I will not have time to turn the crane around and go and grab that. It's just not going to be the time to do it. I, I don't think I could crane that one out, drop it off, get back and crane the other one out if we ignore everything else. <laughs> it's going to be tight just to do that basic part. So, yeah, I mean, we can drive the crane down here. It's going to be difficult to get the crane out. I might have to go... Uh, where's that dump truck gone? I might have to go smash the gate and drive the crane around on the road. I don't want to fart around on rough terrain if I can avoid it. Probably shouldn't have buried this in the hedgerow. Um, come on. Come on, you bugger. Uh, we are going to bounce and... Get stuck. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> the world's most destructive game 
And we are beaten. <laughs> no! Truck, you are useless. Oh! Okay, I'll take it back. You have- you are not useless. Well done. Apparently insult your truck might do the trick. Uh... Ooh, yeah, there's no real good way of doing this, is there? It's either you fight through the trees and the narrow gap, or... You just go through the- I feel like front gate and around is the more efficient way of doing this. Right, hopefully that'll stay busted. Let's keep this bull- this bulldozer, this dump truck out of the way. It's definitely something I feel I'm missing here as to how to do this. But, alas... Uh, I'm not sure I'm ready for this. Oh, and I haven't done the planks yet, actually, have we? Because we're going to start here. We're going to run, 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 run. I mean, I guess I don't... Do I need the planks? We just chuck that out over this way. Is that explosive? Nobody knows! No. <laughs> I say nobody knows. Somebody does. We know now. I was half hoping it might have been. Is that a water barrel? Well, it's empty. Whatever the hell it is. Uh, you can go over there. Uh, right, okay, so we don't really need the planks. I might put one down just because I can. I'm clearing out, I'll clear out as much of the glass so there's less for me to get stuck on while trying to do this. Um, right, here we go. So, we can do that. Perfect. Look at that. Oh. And... Why has that done that? <laughs> it's absolutely sensible, really. This is just make sure I am less likely to fall off. Because you know what I'm like. I am a professional at screwing this sort of stuff up. Hmm. Okay. I think we're ready to give this a go. I don't think I'm going to be able to get the safe out. I'm going to have to have a think about how to do that one. Let's go and give this... A quick so we've still got to do the difficult thing of actually get the main safe in to the boat which I don't think is gonna be all that easy I mean I'm hoping it's gonna be on the more straightforward side of things but I could be very wrong uh, right yes 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 many alarms are blaring etc etc I've gone to the wrong pissing one okay well I've already beans this up a little bit um, this might be a small smidge of a test run uh, right reverse we're going to yoink that out of there. Jeez, yeah, it, re it really is not much in the way of time here. Crane. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. We'll smack that gate out of the way. So if we don't go to the safe, we can definitely do this, I think. It's going to be close, but we can definitely, definitely do this. Uh, yeah, it's going to be damn close, because we're not... Oh! <laughs> okay. Right. So, we ignore the safe, we can definitely do that. That's fine. How that safe is ever... So, so obviously, one of these safes has got to... There's got to be a way you can get the safe without setting the alarm off. There has to be a way to do it, because you can't... There's just not the time to do that. Um... I don't quite know how I managed that jump. I'm Spider-Man, apparently. What looks more likely? No, you see that one there? They're just gonna... fall off. Hmm. There's, oh, there's definitely a trick to removing these alarms. There's Well, there has to be a trick to removing the alarms, because otherwise I don't think you can do that. Uh, maybe we can... Like, shotgun a bit of the wall off? I feel, I feel like shotgunning the wall off is not going to be a way that works here. Um, excuse me? A locked door? <laughs> oh, I love a game. Like, it's always, it's, it's, always, it's always a bit silly in games when you have, you know, shotguns and rocket launchers and still there's a locked door that you can't get through. Well, this one, no such pro problems. But, okay, I fell off a landing. Problem that way, but not other problems. Okay. This is a dumb idea. Damn, there's a strong wall. <laughs> Ow! Okay, I thought I'd throw the whole lot instead I just blew it up in my face. Remember what I said last time about don't give me explosives. Me and explosives is a bad idea. Do 
I, I, yeah, I don't think I can do that. I think we're going to have to... I'm going to have to resign myself to the fact that I can't get that safe. Now, that will save me a lot of time, because we can... So we're ignoring... So it's just run, jump, jump, grab the crane, reverse out, swing it around, go back, grab the other one. We will be good to go. All right, here we go. And run! I'm still pressing shift because I'm expecting it to be a sprint. I don't quite know why, but there we go. That is just the way that it is. Uh, run this way, because I think this will be a quicker way to get into my crane. Bounce off of there. Uh, grab this. Okay, safe. You're coming with me. Don't dump the crane in the water. Uh, right. Oh, God, we're doing the helicopter with the safe. Oh, no, it's gone wrong. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Maybe we need to be a little slower on the turnaround. That's not worked. Oh, dear. Um, little slower on the turning around. We got out the first time. That was fine. Definitely a little slower with the old turning of the vehicle around. Crap. Hmm. Right, let's not let the windmill start. Hold on, we're going to go for ultimate efficiency. How far away from it can I stand and still... There we go. Right. Let the heist begin again. Oh. Right, duck through there. Grab that. Maybe we're... Qu I don't know which way we're quicker going out. I think this way is actually slightly faster. Okay. But well, we do have to be relatively swift here. Uh, there is a time where it's a little too much speed. Don't let the safe hit the boom. Uh, there we go. Right. Okay, we're good. Now, accelerate. We will drive around the knocked over watchtower. That's fine. Uh, this is looking good for time at the moment. This is looking good for time. Just drive towards that. I don't have to drop the safe. It will just be immediately pinged into the boat. Get out of there, because it's no use to me anymore. We will run into here. We will grab that, and we will be clear minus one safe that I am not 100% sure how you get the safe. I really don't know how you get that safe. I mean, it is a good heist for those. And if the safe... If that safe was just a thing I had to pick up, I could do it. There's obviously a trick. There's obviously a trick to, to freeing the alarm somehow. I don't know what else you could do. I mean, maybe if you... If you cleared out the buildings enough so you could drop the safes into the back of the dump truck? Oh, that feels really difficult to do. That feels really unlikely to work, if I'm honest. I guess you could, because the crane can't pick up to it. What, and if it could, I wouldn't have time. So you'd have to knock the first safe into the dump truck, drive to the next one, and be able to knock it in immediately. Yeah, I'm not sure. That's a cool mission. I mean, I do like the missions. The time is it's difficult doing these in sort of 60 seconds. I love the sort of the prep work that goes with it. It's great fun. There's definitely a knack that I've not quite got there. Maybe we get a tool later on that allows us to come back and three-star this. I don't know. Sometimes some games work like that. That might be something that happens. As it is, clearly, I can't, I don't think. So let's go back. Did we get anything new? I bet we need to get something at level 30 or whatever. But... Uh, there we go. That is going to be it for this, uh, oh, uh, kind of. That is going to be it for this, for this video. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'm sure we'll be back with some more teardown, figuring out, well, some stuff. Hopefully, slightly more successful heisting, but who knows. Yeah. <laughs> Until next time, a uh, goodbye.